Good afternoon and welcome to Callaway Park. We've got a lot of Cornish mizzle hanging about in the air. It's made the pitch very, very wet. And as I, as I would say and enjoy, it's, uh, it's forwards weather out there today. Um, Helston with their second consecutive home game after their excellent 5-1 win against Street last week um, are entertaining Ilfacombe, who actually they just played a couple of weeks ago and, uh, and a, a quite dullish 0-0 draw. So everything to play for this week. We're, uh, we're back. Mr Huckle, Purim Films, he's uh, fit and well from uh, last week's uh, little, uh, little illness. But um, we're hoping there's going to be plenty, plenty of action here today. All the highlights brought to you by Purim Films. Out. Three yards from the touchline. Drives it in flat and Colwell. Manages to clear, but the wind drags it back in. Ilfra can get in a great ball in into the box. Walters there with a good header. It's come out to the volley. It's miss miss hit, but Colwell's picked it up. Manages to clear the ball. A bit of pinball there between between Cop by and Simmons. The Rosenquest. Puts it in. It's a cop. Cop with a little bit of time. Looks up. Drops it in short. Rosenquest. Colwell. Colwell a little bit tight and pressured. Wants to come out. Jewel with another good touch. Jewel advanced now into the area. Turn it back. Picks it up again from Bentley. Harrison Jewel driving forward. Shanley out wide right. To Jewel to buy can Helston come out the left hand side have his found cop good touch by Colwell out the Rosenquest this is good football by Helston there's about 12 passes already in the involved in this move and a great little ball inside and found Simmons Simmons onto the byline and a little take he turns he's found it back to to Colwell Colwell looking back Rosenquest is fired Short has been it in long. Oh, I tell you. Certainly that had the uh, commentator think it, it's dropped in the back of the net. And a good ball. Turn and Lord. Lord is racing into the left hand side, chased by Bentley. And he's put a super cross in it again. Lovely cross into the ball. Caused Helston a little bit of problems, but Harrison Jewell headed over for a corner. In into that six yard line they are. Corner comes in. Good corner, right into the mix. A great punch, great punch by Moore. And the ball's come back out. We've got somebody down in the box here. I can't see it from here, isn't it? Um, it's Jordan Bentley. I think there's a there's a seagull convention over there. It must be. I've never seen so many of them there. It looks like now, I'll tell you what Jamie, Jamie Simmons is there. It's, uh, you've, you've charged it up, he's charged himself up and he's running out of battery now and he's going, and that's how it looks. He's got to have a, he's got to have a lot more, a lot more energy and aggression about, about him than he's shown in the last ten minutes. The Colwell, Colwell turns back inside to the crowded area, but gets away with it and by, and by trying to force, which he does, up to Simmons and Simmons has found himself. He can still well finish. Great save by McCormick back on his left foot. Dunstan just can't get that ball back in. Great turn, and, great turn and quick feet by Matt By. And Cop now, Cop looking to line one up and line one up, and that's gone down into the town centre. Finds out to Bentley and Bentley with the time again. Shanley, side to Simmons, Simmons at the call. By, by looking to try and. Try and get one of the forwards in wide. He's found Cop. Cop having a look, little look. Jinx back. He's played wide. He's got Simmons wide right of him. Shanley's made a great run. As soon as he's come back on his left foot, he's let one go. Fine, Simmons! Jamie Simmons! The little, he used Reese Shanley as the decoy. Shanley's made a great run round the outside of him. He decides to jink back onto his left foot. From the edge of the box, he's curled a super shot in into the top corner, beating McCormick. And just as we're closing in onto the half time, Helston Athletic take the lead with Jamie Simmons. 1 0. Jules driving forward again. And sloppy play again from uh, Ross Dunstan. If you've enjoyed watching the first half of these video highlights, then please give our channel a boost by giving us the thumbs up. 
Also, do click the subscribe button if you're not part of our non-league football community, and then click on the bell if you'd like notifications of further videos like these. Ilfacombe have been forced to make a second half substitution with their goalkeeper. Uh, Simmons, Simmons have played Shanley. Shan oh, dear me. Jenkins, who was sent off in the last time with the uh, fixture at Ilfracombe just a couple of weeks ago. So with a, a, a real strong challenge on Shanley. You expect at least a, a yellow card. I think it'll be the first yellow card to be shown. It is. Uh, got to be a better runner. And there's a, that, that run into the area. But Ilfracombe now trying to get in. Stevens with the strike at goal in a great block by Harrison Jewell. Oh, and a little bit of excitement from Jenkins. He looks back at the pitch, and I'm sorry, mate. <laughs> that was uh, nothing to do with the pitch. And he blasts high over the bar, but a great, great saving block tattle by Harrison Jewell. Steve has looked to direct the, the wall, and he's got into position. I take it it's going to be short from here. He does. It's gone long in left, and oh! That must have been close by the reaction of the Ilfracombe players as well. Soft spot is still there's a huge area that soft spot is open there. It's gone, it's dropped in onto more. Bentley's won the ball well. He's headed it out. Good header by Bentley. It's good and it's and it's not wrong back into the area. Jewel and Bentley have and their referee gives nothing. Cop Cop has won that well. It's Cop, he's got he's got Rosen Quest firing it down the outside of him. Cops rolled him in. Can Rosenquest finish the two? Can he? And he has. Tegan Rosenquest showed all the composure. The top talented player he is. Jordan Cop taking it on his chest from the halfway line. Swivelled with it. Carried the ball. Played a perfect pass into Rosenquest. He steadies himself. Calmly slots in the onrushing Thorn to make it Helston Athletic 2. Ilfracombe 0. Rosenquest fresh from his goal. He's won the ball well and he's jinked inside his right plane. He's just trying to play cop in. He's bringing that Bentley onto the ball first. Shanley's wide at right here. Take this in his right foot, one touch and finds Colwell. Colwell, good running. There, turns on his left foot. Can he get a crossing? He can. It's gone back post. Wilson's trying to get in there. Payne. Oh, and Payne just couldn't. Payne just couldn't reach the ball. Ilfraku managed to get that away and turn themselves into an attack. Stevens on the ball here. Left hand side, face with Jewel. Jewel forcing him back. Stevens has played, trying to play it long. Stories with it's bad touch by Story. And it's a great ball in, but he's offside. So he's offside there. That was surely offside. Surely that's offside. Oh, dearie me. Good chest by uh, Wilson. He's found Cop and Cop's dropped the ball inside to Payne. Payne can get he gets in it first time and it's a great ball, super ball across the box from Tom Payne. Ruby Wilson just unable to get in and great defending from from the Ilfacum side. Thorn Thorn has done well in the goal. You wouldn't you wouldn't think that he was a he was a standing goalkeeper. But Jewel wins the ball high. Up. Colwell wins it back again. Wilson. Wilson's jinked inside. He's got a chance to score. And Wilson. Ruben Wilson, who's been without a goal for a number of games, come on as a substitute and has shown lots and lots of class. Spins the centre half. Draws the keeper and with great composure again, slots it in with the left foot to make it Helston Athletic 3. Ilfracu 1. By a lovely turn by Cop. And Cop drawing in there. Wilson now full of running. The goal from his goal. <laughs> Drops it back in the Shanley. Shanley's playing the Colwell. Colwell dropped back to Bai. Bai's looking forward as Cop's come to join him. Flicks it inside. His left foot. And beautiful play by Helston. Into Payne. Payne's gone for a curler. Oh! A super, super play. Well, here an exciting moment for, uh, for Josh Daniels and his family. He's going to be going to make his debut. Just turned 16. He's coming to make a deal for Tegan Rosenquest. He's had a great game. Front scored a goal. Tegan's got his, his goal of the season. And um, good luck, young man. Good luck.
Jordan Cop, who's had an excellent game, excellent game today. In fact, he's been in the unusual position of leading the line in the second half. And on his come to see um, Rocco Hill. Back to Bentley. Good triangles, a nice play by him. Finds Colwell. Colwell with time into Josh Story. And Josh Story spotted Josh Daniels racing away down the left hand side. He's onto it early. He's put a great ball into the ball. Oh, and he's just got across to Colwell. Colwell a little too heavy with his touch, but he gets away with it. And he's found the ball's broke through to Wilson. Wilson's eyeing him up. Left hand side, he's dropped. Hill on the outside. But Hill, Hill has been shot by that sniper in the tree and falls over. Helston keeping the ball here now. And again, Col Colwell and uh, Maddie Bai dictating things in the middle of the park. It's played Hill in. Hill has got a great opportunity to make it four. And Rocco Hill! Just coming on a substitute, runs over to his dad. Great to see, son and father. And no doubt he's got that on his camera as well. Picture of his goal. Rocco Hill not on for five minutes, the substitute. The 17 year old races through. A super pass, keeps the composure again and slides the fourth Helston goal. They make it right on time now. It's Helston Athletic, four. Ilfracoon, one. There we go. See if I can call it. I think he's going to blow his whistle. There we go. Right, bang on time. With the added time on. As the game comes to an end, which has been a very, very entertaining second half, I have to say. With four goals to one. And it's goodbye from me, from Kellaway Park. It's goodbye from Mr. Huckle.